company called the Bysky is still just a concept. Now the company Gibbs Amphibians is looking for investors to mass-produce its sports amphibians. This model is more suitable for fans of high-speed driving, as on land the Bysky develops a speed of up to 128 km per hour. The speed of driving on the water is much less, up to 60 km per hour, but this is actually still quite impressive. On land, the Bysky looks like an ordinary motorcycle, and in the water it's more like a scooter. It's noteworthy that this transformation doesn't take more than 5 seconds. Interestingly, the company Gibbs Amphibians has been producing amphibious vehicles since 2003. When they created their first unique amphibian, they were inspired by James Bond movies. Atacama 7900 Function Motorhomes can have very different sizes and designs. Not every model can boast of having a specially equipped parking lot in the rear compartment, but the Atacama 7900 Function can. Moreover, this house on wheels is also equipped with a hydraulic lift, which despite the considerable weight of the car, raises and lowers it. It's amazing that competing models are able to accommodate only a passenger car in the parking compartment. The Atacama 7900 Function is equipped with a spacious parking space, which can fit a Suzuki Jimny in. It's not very big, but it's still an SUV. Such vehicles are produced by the Austrian company Action Mobil. The 7900 Function belongs to the model range of motorhomes Atacama and combines creativity and amazing functionality, according to the manufacturer. The company Action Mobil produces quite a large number of different mobile homes. The Atacama 7900 Function is one of the largest models, mainly because the parking compartment has a very impressive size. Aeromobile 4.0 For a long time, people have been dreaming of cars that could soar into the air. In recent decades, various global companies have been developing new technologies to finally reach this future, where we will fly to work instead of walking or taking a bus. A new prototype of a flying car, the Aeromobile 4.0, was shown in Frankfurt about a year ago. It is amazing, but according to the manufacturer, very soon this model will be available for order. The very first prototype, the Aeromobile 1.0, was shown to the public in 1990. It's expected that in 2020, the first real flying cars will be seen on the streets. However, the cost is quite high about one and a half million dollars for one vehicle.
the Aeromobile 4.0 has a futuristic appearance. The wings are equipped with solar panels that power the battery as well. According to preliminary data, the power reserve of the Aeromobile 4.0 on land will only be 100 kilometers, but by air it will be able to move up to a distance of 1,000 kilometers. Deserts a lot, never in something that just feels this capable. <laughs> what a device! I love this thing. 750 horsepower, 6.6 .6 liter V8 Duramax engine. I've never been in a vehicle you can't damage. I thought I could wreck anything, apparently not. <laughs> That's good driving, Jay. Yeah, I gotta get one of these. Repsol was something that none of us had ever seen before. So in the testing phase, we tried to break it. Action! See what we can do, but, but we really couldn't break this thing. It was indestructible. The Green Rock Dog Adventure holidays can be very different, but it turns out you can get an adrenaline rush without even leaving your car. Although the car should be special, for example, this Green Rock Dog. The vehicle that you see on your screen is an electric prototype. Such cars have not yet been mass-produced. Nevertheless, this hydraulic all-terrain vehicle stands out for both its appearance and outstanding technical characteristics. This unique design of the wheels allows the car to overcome obstacles of up to 2.5 meters high. At first glance, the Green Rock Dog evokes associations with a spider, and just like these creatures, the car is able to move in very difficult terrain. The car is the result of the long work of a man named Alec Yeager, an avid rock climber. When folded, the green rock dog is quite compact, its width is about 1.5 meters. When the car expands the wheels, its width increases to 4.2 meters. It's noteworthy that each wheel has a completely independent suspension. That is, its height and the trajectory doesn't depend on the movement of the other wheels. It can move on rough terrain at a speed of 60 km per hour. However, of course, while overcoming obstacles, the crawler moves much slower. Look at that thing! Bringing it in, making it short. Hum Rider. Everyone has been in a traffic jam, when the cars barely move and you're dying to get to your destination. 
At such moments, people usually dream about vehicles that could overcome traffic jams. So, such a car already exists. It's the Hum Rider. This vehicle can be considered a jack car, a transforming car, and even a car of the future. All thanks to the unique structure of the wheels. After pressing a special button in the cabin, the car spreads its wheels and then rises to a height of slightly less than 2 meters. In this state, it's able to pass over passenger cars without touching them. The vehicle was created by the American company A2ZFX, and unfortunately it's the only model, created not even for sale but just to attract attention. The basis for the transforming car was a Jeep 